Hey crypto friends, for those of you who are new to my channel, my name is Garrett and welcome to Altcoin Radar. In today's short deep dive video, you are going to learn all about a DeFi project called Change Finance. Now, for those of you who are new to the channel, if you are interested in trading and would like to try out the same exchange that I use, feel free to go ahead and check out the Mexi Crypto Exchange with the link in the video description down below this video. I personally love this exchange for two big reasons. The first one is because I'm a huge altcoin nerd and Mexi has over 1500 different altcoins for me to buy and trade at any given time. And two, the next reason I really love it is because as you guys can clearly see, they've got the, some of the cheapest fees in the entire industry right now. Um, roughly most uh, most other exchanges are charging 0.06%. Mexi is charging 0.01%. So you get to keep more of your profits by trading on this exchange, which is very, very nice. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and ch uh, check out change. Um, as you guys know, as, as we all know, in the ever-evolving world of cryptocurrencies, Innovation is literally the driving force that pushes boundaries of what's possible, right? And one such innovation is change, all right? Which is basically a platform that's changing the way that we think about crypto finance. So what exactly is it though? On a surface level, change is basically a decentralized finance platform that wants to bridge the overall gap between traditional finance and, you know, the world of crypto. Um, basically, it's on a mission. It, its basic mission is to make decentralized finance accessible to literally everyone, regardless of their level of expertise in blockchain technology. So, realistically, it's just another D big DeFi platform. But let's go ahead and talk about some of its key features here. All right. So, the first key feature is its user friendly mobile application. Okay. One of the standout features of Change is its user-friendly mobile app, which basically, you know, provides a seamless experience for users, uh, pretty much making it easy to manage their crypto assets, trade, um, and access DeFi services all on the go, which is very nice. And this approach overall opens up the world of DeFi to a much broader audience, uh, basically eliminating the need for complex technical knowledge like you typically need with some other DeFi platforms out there, all right? Now, the next thing we've got here is multi-chain integration. Change finance isn't limited to just a single blockchain. It offers multi-chain integration, allowing users to interact, you know, with various blockchain networks, including Ethereum, Binance Smart Chain, uh, Polkadot, and, you know, many, many more as well. And this type of flexibility overall ensures that users have access to a very wide range of assets and services. Now, my favorite aspect of this project is the decentralized um, the ugh, the decentralized identities. Okay, so basically, change places a strong emphasis on security and privacy as well. And so basically, it incorporates decentralized identity solutions to basically ensure that user data is protected, uh, which overall is going to you know reduce the risk of identity theft and data breaches. And honestly. This is an approach that I'd personally like to see more of in the future with DeFi platforms as well, because realistically, digital identities is an awesome, awesome thing to have. So the next thing we've got here is staking and yield farming, all right, in which, you know, everybody knows what staking and yield farming is. But if you don't or whatever, um, the platform basically offers opportunities for users to earn passive income through, you know, staking and yield farming. And users can basically lock up their crypto assets and receive rewards in return, contributing to the overall growth of the whole ecosystem as a whole. Now, the next thing we're going to talk about here is change swap. Okay. Change swap is basically changes decentralized exchange or DEX um, that allows users to swap various cryptocurrencies without the need for a centralized intermediary, obviously. And this enables users to trade assets securely and efficiently. And lastly, they've got their cross chain NFT marketplace, which is basically going to allow users to create buy and sell nfts across all kinds of different blockchain networks so why does this project matter exactly here's the thing all right there's three different things here um, we've got accessibility interoperability and security so for accessibility changes mobile app and user-friendly interface make DeFi accessible to a broader broader audience breaking down barriers to entry which is honestly one of the big key things among various decentralized applications and stuff like that because there's honestly not a lot of them that have mobile applications 
So the fact that change is doing that and making that possible is a very nice thing to see. Now the next cool thing is interoperability, where the multi-chain integration basically ensures that you know users are not limited to a single blockchain network, uh, which basically enhances the flexibility and utility of the overall platform. Now lastly, we've got security. Um, Change's emphasis on decentralized identities and security measures basically fosters trust among users, uh, making it a safe platform for managing you know, their assets and engaging in various DeFi activities as well. Overall here, you guys, change is not just another crypto project. It basically represents a paradigm shift in how we interact with de uh, decentralized finance. Um, its user-friendly approach, multi-chain integration, and emphasis on security positions it as a front-runner of the world of DeFi, in my personal opinion. And as change continues to grow and evolve, it has the potential, it literally has the potential to reshape the future of crypto finance, making it more accessible and inclusive for everybody, because this is a huge thing, you guys. Um, now, I really don't think that a lot of people think about this type of stuff, but if we want widespread adoption, we need to make it easy for people to use, all right? And in, the, in a world where everybody's using, you know, their hand, their their phones and their smartphones in their hand and stuff like that, we need more of these apps to be available for people to use on their phones. So, you know, stuff like this is a very nice thing to see. But overall here, you guys, if any of you guys have any questions about anything that I mentioned in this video um, related to change finance or anything that's related to altcoins or trading in general, feel free to go ahead and reach out to me in my free community, community Discord server, which you can find a link to in the description below this video as well. But overall here, you guys, that's gonna pretty much do it for this video. So I will go ahead and wrap this one up. But before you guys leave, if you haven't already, go ahead and make sure to subscribe to my channel so that you never miss a new crypto and altcoin video from me on a regular basis. And hey guys, with that said, thanks again for watching and I hope to see you guys in the comment section um, of my future videos.